Hi everyone, Denise Robinson from By The Bay Kinesiology. Today I'm going to be doing a card review of the sacred symbol cards and accompanying reference chart. So let's get in and have a look. First of all, we're going to go through the cards. So they come in a drawstring cotton natural bag and inside, there's the bag, um, inside here's the cards. And the back is an Ank, um, ancient Egypt symbol. So that's them there. And then let's have a look at all of the cards that are in the deck. So you've got Ajna, Anahata, hopefully I say all of these correctly, Anubis, Bagua, Balinese Om, Bindi, Buddha Leaf, Buddha, Corticus, Khan, Celtic Cross, Celtic Trinity Knot, and they're all numbered so you can see the number at the top here for each set. Um, Chaos Star, Chinese Dragon, Christian Cross, Comet. Conch Shell, Dharma Wheel, Dodectahedron, all the sacred geometry shapes are in this deck. Uh, Double Happiness, it's number 20. 21 is your dream catcher. Earth Element, all the elements are in here too. Fire, Earth, Metal, Water, Wood. Egyptian Ank, Endless Knot, Eye of God, Eye of Horus, Fire Element. Flower of Life, Fruit of Life, Ganesh, Gordian Knot, Hamza, Healer's Hand, Heart, Hecate Wheel, Hexahedron, Isohedron, Yana's Knot, Infinity, Isis Goddess, Jizo, Kuan Yin, Labyrinth, Labrys, Lakota, Laughing Buddha, Lotus Flower, Mart, Maltese Cross, Mandala, Manipura, so all the chakra symbols are here as well, Medicine Wheel, Merkaba, Metal Element, Malahudra, Malahudara, uh, Namaste, Nautilus Shell, the Nine Pointed Star, Octahedron, Om, Pagoda, Peace Symbol, Pentacle, Pentagram, Raven, Rod of Oscalispus, Sahasara, Seed of Life, the Show, Fear, Spiral, Sri Antra, Star of David, Shwadhishana, Tetrahedron, Tree of Life, Triple Spiral, Triple Moon, Trishula, Tugra Inati, don't know if I said that right, um, Inalomi, Unicorn, Vajra, Vishuddha, Water Element, Weeping Buddha, Wisdom Eyes of Buddha, Wood Element, Yin Yang, and the lucky last one is Zen Circle. So there's 90 cards in the deck, and then there's a little description about how you can use them. Um, and with how you can use them, um, so there's the deck there. It's quite a big deck. I mean, it's in a bag because the boxes... Um, don't come as a standard box. It's not your standard 44 card deck. It's a 90 card deck. Um, and then what we've got is a, is a reference chart that goes with it. So sacred symbol reference chart. And on this, this has the number which corresponds to the card. Um, you've got the symbol again from the card. Um, you've got the meaning and symbology of it, the shadow attributes and the light attributes. And you've got this for all of them. So it's a 10 page or five double-sided page laminated um 
sheet which goes through all the meanings and symbology of all of the 90 symbols. And then the way in which you can use it is using the actual symbol. Um, you can place this on the body of the person that you're working with. If you're a therapist, you can test up. If you're a kinesiologist, use muscle reflex testing to test via number to work with um, which symbol the person needs or what's most relevant. You can shuffle a muscle test through them um, or you can get someone just to pick a number and they pick a number and whatever number it is, then you just scan through and find which number and then what that means to them. There's so many ways you can use them. I loved creating this deck of sacred symbol cards and the reference chart. If you would like them, you can head to my website, www.bythebaykinesiology.com.au and get your hands on a sacred symbol cards and reference chart set. Thanks for watching.